Not even the cricketing gods could have predicted what transpired on Saturday when the West Indies were rooted out for a mere 55 runs. Assistant coach of the Windies, Roddy Estwick, says that it's early days in competition and losing one match does not say much. We, we realised that we had a bad game. We've, we've had a chat, chat about it. Um, the players had um, some volleyball yesterday to help them to relax, to try and build some team spirit. We, we're about to have a practice session now. The, the one thing you can do is you can, once you lose a game, you can look for all the excuses in the world. You can, you can nitpick all you want. You know, you've got to back the players. Our, our job is to, to get the players up, make sure they remain confident, make sure they still believe in their ability. He also defended Chris Gale's positioning as the number three batsman, saying that his seniority and experience way surpasses his total run scored over the past few months. Chris has been a wonderful servant for West Indies cricket. We still expect great things from him. But he also has a lot in terms of in the dressing room, in terms of helping the younger players. You know, sometimes we tend just to look at performances and we tend to think that, you know, um, the numbers don't match up. But there's a lot more to, to a cricketer and there's a lot more to an experienced player in terms of the dressing room, in terms of helping the youngsters, in terms of helping on the field as well. Coach Estwick also shared a light moment suggesting that the worst is now in the rear view, never to return. It can't go any worse than the weekend I've had. Um, big um, support of Man United, we lost 5 nil, and we lost the game on Saturday, so the weekend hasn't been the best, so hopefully tomorrow things will start turning around and for the better.